Hey there, all my beautiful pink ladies. It's your girl, Pinky, coming with story time. I have two stories to share with you lovely ladies. First and foremost, let me start off by saying hope everyone is having a blessed week. Tomorrow is Wednesday, hump day. The week is almost over. Weekend's coming where you can relax and just enjoy your time off. And y'all, I have had a hell of a week and a half or last couple days things have been rough so you know i share with you people and i miss y'all i haven't really been uploading any videos i miss my pink ladies i hope everyone is okay you know i still read all the comments and whatnot so let me go ahead and share the first um story or thing i want to share with you ladies is um, I know you ladies are like, okay, come on now, Pinky, where are our gifts, our, you know, ultimate prize winner and the runner-ups, you know, I had all of that stuff handled, went to the post office, but of course I had drama, it's been hectic for me, I went to the post office to send that stuff off, and then I lost $200. Dollars. Then my phone's been acting up and then my daughter needed care package because she said the school had been tripping on, on Sundays in college. She wasn't getting a full meal. She said that Sunday they had only given her a grilled cheese sandwich, one grilled cheese sandwich per student and it's just been a mess. So I didn't forget about you ladies. I just been running around like a chicken with my head cut off and then all my friends fuss at me because they say, you know, I'm always trying to do everything for everybody else and I don't slow down and take time for myself and, you know, blah, 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 fussing. But I think I take time, you know, for myself and make sure everything is done and organized and whatnot. So that's not true. But I always want to see a smile on everyone's face and I want to make sure I can help out everyone as much as I can. So, you know, I do what I can. And, and, you know, if it takes me running here, running there, doing this and doing that, I'm going to do so. But, you know, of course, you know, the kids come first. I had to, you know, take care of my daughter first and get her a box off and get her some things to Tuskegee College. She's a junior and, you know, they always need something. And then, um, you know, the phone situation, Lord have mercy. I thought I was going to have to pay $150 for another phone, but, you know, I prayed about it. And God is good, as you ladies can see, it's working perfectly. My coloring came back, so I am super happy about that. And now I can woosah and get the rest of the things that I had planned done. So don't worry, it will be coming to your mailbox soon. Still have faith in you, girl. Thanks for being so patient. The second thing I wanted to share with you ladies, so, you know, um, I stay in this big apartment duplex where it has like this middle little garden and the mailbox everything is so different it's really cute i'm gonna have to do a video one day and upload and show you guys how we walk in and whatnot but you know i see the kids on a daily and they grow up around just like grow up around the area and you get to know the kids and whatnot and right now there's you know maybe like five young men that i know um that hang out together and they range from the age of um, 10 to 15 if I'm not mistaken or maybe 11 to 15 somewhere up in there so I was coming in today and they all call me hi they they say pinky or they say hi miss pinky and I go hey fellas how you doing and then I speak to the girls and whatnot so me and my friend we were coming in and we were just laughing and talking and then 10 minutes later there's a knock at the door so I go to the door and it's um like three of the young boys that I talked to. So I'm like, what's up, what's up? Y'all selling something? What's going on? You know, I joke and play with them. And um, they were like, no, Miss Pinky. And they was like, Jason has something to tell you. And this is one of the little boys that's there. And um, he's Puerto Rican and black. So um, I was like, what's up, Jason? What's up? What you got to tell me? So he was like, I have something to give you. And he was, and I was like, what? And I said, what do you have for me? And he was like, um, you're not going to laugh, are you? And I was like, no, I wouldn't laugh. I was like, what is it? Come on, you can tell me. You can share with me. And he was like, I think you're pretty and you're so nice. And I want to know if you would be my girlfriend. And if you would um, 
keep my cologne because it makes me smell good and the girls at school like it. So look what he gave me. <laughs> and I was like, oh, how sweet is this? So he gave me his little polo cologne. And you can tell he's been using it because look, it's not that much in there. And I thought that was so adorably sweet so i told him thank you i gave him a hug and i was like unfortunately sweetie i cannot be your girlfriend because miss pinky is too old for you miss pinky can go to jail you don't want to see miss pinky in handcuffs do you and he was like no 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 and i was like but now i know what you like and i was like that was sweet and you're really handsome and i was like but find your girlfriend at school and then i closed the door and i was like what i felt you know a little good i was like look i got the little fellas liking me hey now what 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 that may sound kind of crazy but you know it was cute i was like i had a a guy that had a little crush on me so now if i can get a grown man to act like that but don't bring me no half a bottle of no cologne you know no shit like that but yeah, those are my two stories I wanted to share with you pink ladies and to let you pink ladies know that I miss you so very much. But it looks like your girl is back in effect and got things up and running. And be on the lookout because I got some more uploaded videos coming up for you soon. So to all my pink ladies, take care. Continue to have a blessed week and I'll see you in the next video. Love you ladies.